the kind of technologies that they're expecting of you is if you are not yet graduated uh, you can still go ahead and make a really good the deadline to pr uh, apply for this is somewhere around so how do you prepare for all of these advanced topics like Hello everybody and welcome to another hiring alert from Edist. If you are liking these hiring alert segments, please make sure you subscribe to our channel so that you get the notification every time we do release a hiring alert. Hit the like button and make sure to share with your friends, especially the ones who are searching for a job. Today's hiring alert is from Mastercard. Yes, uh, that Mastercard, the most famous uh, Mastercard of uh, the payment gateways as well as the credit cards, the debit cards and so on. And so this is a MasterCard hiring alert and we are going to discuss three things as usual. Number one, uh, what is uh, the job role all about? What are the things that you need to know? Number two, what is generally the pattern like and what's the eligibility like? And number three, how you can go ahead and apply for this role as well. So let's get started. Uh, number one, this role is of a junior software engineer and we assume that the eligibility is going to be for 2019, 2020 and 2021. Why do we say this? Well, it is of a junior software engineer role and the job description does not specifically mention that you, you have to be a 2020 graduate or 2021 graduate. But what it does show is that it's somewhere for freshers. So if you are a fresher or if you had like a six months or a one year experience, then probably you can go for this role. And usually speaking, that falls under 2019, 2020 and 2021 graduate currently. Hence, we have assumed that this is the case. But if you're a 2018 graduate or a 2017 graduate, by all means, go ahead and apply. It is an off campus role after all. Uh, it's just that your experience may not be considered again, seeing as it's a junior software engineer role. The kind of technologies that they're expecting of you is Android or Java or C++. They're not expecting all of them, but you know, at least one of these is what they're expecting from you. And usually speaking, it is eight lakhs per annum is the job uh, is a uh, is a package for MasterCard. Again, it could be more, uh, but I'm just saying that as per the, the trends and as per what we've seen that they offer, this is the case. Uh, they've not specifically mentioned this on their website or on their job description currently. Um, so while this is the eligibility, what is the pattern that you can expect? Well, again, this is an off campus round. So the pattern may differ from team to team and candidate to candidate. But more often than not, we've seen this is a standard pattern or that most product companies follow. And we've actually verified this with some other people who've gone through the rounds. Um, the rounds are generally speaking, one or two coding rounds and then a couple of interviews after that. And in the coding rounds, you have the same things that most product based companies ask. That is arrays, strings, data structures, dynamic programming, a little bit of maths, some bit manipulation. So all of those topics. And in the technical interviews, uh, you would again get the same all algos and data structures concepts as well as projects. If you have not done a good project or a technical internship, uh, then you know your chances go down. But if you've done a really good project and your technical internship is good, or even if you just have a really good project, then your technical interviews will be that much better. So, you know, try to focus on those things, especially if you are not yet graduated, uh, you can still go ahead and make a really good project, uh, you know, and if you don't have one, you know, just go and make one right now. You may not be eligible for this role, but for all future roles, you could start being eligible for it as well. So how do you prepare for all of these advanced topics like arrays, strings, data structures, dynamic programming, uh, algos, data st uh, structures concept? Well, you can prepare for them through the advanced algos and data structures bootcamp from Edist. Uh, we've launched this bootcamp and uh, we uh, are currently running a batch on it. Uh, so, you know, you can check out the link over here or in the description below. Uh, and you know, the same thing, if you want to, if you're not really good at algos and data structures, you at least want to start with a programming language. Uh, for this role, you could check out the Java programming course, which again is mentioned in the description below. You could check out those things as well. And um, yes, so that's, uh, th that's mainly it. Uh, you know, you can just check out these uh, courses for your preparation. In these co courses, we give you full hands-on experience. At the advanced algos data structures, you get you know live sessions with a mentor uh, that is me, and you also get like you know practice sessions led by mentors. So you know this is the kind of course that you can do and actually get started for product-based companies. Um, to know the the job description, how and where you can find the job description, you can again find it in the description of this video. It's in the link. 
uh, the link is in the description below and uh, you know once you go there you'll actually be redirected to the edist platform where and this is what actually opens up for you so this is how it looks like uh, this is not only this role uh, which is the mastercard role but if you can see on the left side we have a bunch of different roles so make sure you always checking the edist.com uh, jobs portal where we keep shortlisting such, such jobs for you uh, we have a dedicated team that keeps shortlisting such jobs for you so you don't have to do it yourself uh, you can just keep going to edist.com slash jobs and keep finding all of these particular courses as well uh, again the deadline to apply for this is somewhere around 14th march but do check out the the link on their official website and yeah these are this is the job description and you'll find the official link as well over here again the the link to this job description is uh, in the description below so right everybody that was mainly it from this hiring alert i hope you enjoyed it uh, a pretty short hiring alert but yeah i hope you enjoyed it and if you want to uh, prepare for such product based companies don't forget to visit our advanced algos course over here uh, if you have any other doubts or queries you can always reach out to us on whatsapp on this number and uh, and on email on this number thanks again for watching this video and i'll see you all next time all the best everybody and thank you so much